Okay. March 4, 4 2, 0, 1, 4. This dog came suddenly okay. this morning. This is a Prisa, nine year old female. Came suddenly with fits and uh, the gums were very pale. The owner said there were ticks on her ears and had never used spot on, believing that it's toxic. So now we are given drips and duphalites. And now I check the gums again and uh, pull up a bit more so I can see up some more. And the gum looks more pink than this morning. The other side, check the other side. Yeah, it's, it definitely press the gums near the tooth there, the tooth. Okay. The, the, the canine, uh, the capillary refill time, yeah. Uh, it seems to be surprisingly quite, quite good. And the dog barks and looks active. So, now I will check the blood smear. The smear shows that he's got uh, Babesia gypsonii. This was done this morning. And uh, as you can see, there was a photo uh, from the microscope of the blood smear. And in this blood smear microscope, you can see the echinocytes, which is a breakdown of the red blood cells. And uh, the normal red blood cell is rounded, whereas the echinocytes are those with spikes due to the breakdown of the red blood cells. Now the papis here, Gibson eye, can see, you can see has a small dot in a halo inside the red blood cell and uh, there's, there's a lot, in fact the platelet count is low and uh, so I'm surprised this dog is still standing now as to the fits it could be due to anemia or due to the fact that the baby here might have gone to the brain uh, so he has been given anti-fit anima, two valves, and uh, he looks much better. And so far, from 9 a.m. to now, which is 5 p.m., he's definitely much more alert, and he's much loved by his owner. I often see him running around in the industrial park outside my clinic too and uh, I'm surprised she is 9 years old and uh, and uh, had never had tick fever before to prevent tick fever it's best to use a uh, spot on otherwise it's difficult the blood test results have not come in yet uh, March 4, 2014 top air vets babesiosis top uh, March 5pm